As of tonight, we have seen the faces of 16 of the 21 victims who were lost on Tuesday, but they are being remembered night after night all across the country in touching tributes. Our Roseanne Aragon joins us live now from Fort Bend County, where a candlelight vigil was held there tonight. Roseanne. Yes, the community came together on the steps of this Justice Center to honor the memory of those who died. They prayed, they cried, and called for change. A civilized society's character is determined by how we take care of our little ones. Most gracious God, we pause before your presence. When uncertainty hits home, as a people, we remember, as a county, coming together on the steps of justice. This was a census act, and these children didn't deserve it. Fort Bend County Judge K.P. George, residents and local leaders honor the lives. 19 babies and two adults. A heartbreak for Uvalde that knows no geographical lines. You feel helpless because these children were helpless and there was nothing that anyone could do. Parents, children, leaders. This could have been us. Yearn to do more. The voice and the souls of these children and their families are crying for action. We have to be the citizens of this country that takes this moment to lead us forward together. This is not a Democrat or a Republican issue. This is an American issue. Young voices now sharing. It really upsets me. Saying more can be done. Maybe more protection over the kids so they won't have to go through that, something like that again. Parents and children telling us tonight something must be done to stop the violence. Reporting live from Fort Bend County, the Justice Center, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, 2 News.